Welcome back everybody to Westbridge Hills 17 Farm Simulator 17 here on Mr. Blue Farms. Woo hoo hoo. I have no idea why I'm around this tractor, but okay. Go down here to the combines. Folks, I want to apologize. I've been busy today. I'm tired. I'm wore out. And I know I'm complaining. We're going to get these machines going. Uh, barley, dropping straw, I think. Probably going to do this this field, and and that'll be. Oh man, that was unfolded. I can't remember what was. I gotta get those wood pieces up. I think it was R. Yeah. Well, all the fingers are looking good. Yep, that's good. Sharp. But anyways, uh, uh, like I said, I, I'm sorry. I want to apologize. This video probably will be short. But let me explain. All right, I'm trying to get a drone. Okay. I think all y'all know that. For every video I talked about, I've been talking about drones. Well, I had a chance to sell my boat today to one of my buddy firefighters. He uh, basically went ahead and bought it off my hands for me after all the headache today we went through with it. Um, started out about 9 o'clock, and this is on a Saturday. I know y'all watching this on Sunday, but you know, it's, I'm a day be behind, right? Or y'all day ahead or something i don't know but anyway saturday morning nine o'clock he drops by you still want to sell your boat i thought he was kidding i'm sorry chad chad smith or oops uh, chad smith are you watching uh, uh, i hope you don't mind me telling the story but anyway came by at nine o'clock i'm like yeah yeah i'll we'll sell it because i want a drone well, I ain't going to go into the price and all that because basically it's none of y'all's business. But anyway, we got out there to try to get it to start and uh, got it where it hit, you know. So uh, I'm like, okay, this is pretty good. So yeah, hang on a second. Uh, why I'm over so far? I done the GPS and that's the length that this thing is so it wasn't no reason of uh, you know over overlapping or anything like that that's what I'm gonna say we'll go ahead and get him started and uh but anyway like I was saying you know we tinkered around with it went got out in the chute I was loading some of the fishing stuff up. I was running around. I had to go get gas and the oil and, and the bait and, and and this and that, you know. And I forgot the main thing that I was needing. Paddles. I forgot my paddle. I know better than that. Oh, uh, oh you're empty. Uh oh, spaghetti -o. Uh-oh. Don't look like we're going to have time to wait on that anyway. But, um, yeah, I got out in the chute. Um, it fired up, so I got out there and got it started. It ran about a good five seconds to get me out in the middle, and it just died and stalled. I'm like, oh, my God. I, actually, I need to back up to all the funk, gunk, or whatever you want to call it, that was in a gas line. Now, it's been sitting about four or five months. And I had a rubber gas line going all the way from the front of the boat to the back. The gas tank was fine. But that, that line, I guess, sitting in the sun all day long. So I should have had a tarp over it, but I didn't. My sucker had so much gunk and stuff in it, it was unreal. Hey, Mr. Stop, stop, stop. 
but uh, finally got all the gunk out of it and uh, all the way down to the plunger. And I'm like, well, the gas that was running out of the plunger looked pretty good. Well, I should have known better right then. There, from the plunger to the... Oh, Lordy. Please stop. Oh, you got to be kidding me. You got to be kidding me. Fold you up, buttercup. Like a solo cup. We got to get some uh, liquid fertilizer down here for him. But anyway, uh, yeah, the plunger to the motor I forgot to do. And that's why it stalled on me out in the chute. You know, I, I should have known better. Uh, had a box cutter and some needle nose. Or, I don't know what you would cut. They're wire cutters, what they was, what wasn't needle nose. And I finally got the filter off that mounts to the block. Or the motor got it off and you should have seen all kind of junk coming out of that i'm like oh my god i'm like no wonder but i kind of drifted towards the bank a little bit and uh his brother and somebody else had to get a rope flow to me and help me get back down to the bank to the boat ramp so we uh worked on it flow some new gas to it and Stupid fool me didn't realize, you know, hey, you just uh, got gunk out from the plunger to the filter. Now, from the filter to the carburetor, you know, it's going to be more gunk. Wasn't thinking nothing about it. I sure wouldn't. Not one bit. Went out and um, started back up. Man, you talking about something running like a scalded dog. That sucker like ran good for about three minutes. Enough to get me up to the chute. Which is probably not quite half. I would say by half, about a quarter to a half a mile. Somewhere wrong in there. Going up. Oh, come on, I would say. Dang, he's almost full too. I gotta find a truck. Alright, this guy can start plowing. Uh, this, what is this? This is the T7. I, I put the duals on it. I've got plenty of power to pull that. But anyway, to kind of make it short. Hey, you want a little drone? I need to. I don't know. I, I guess my controller, my D-pad, left stick on my D-pad is getting bad because I got to really push that circle hard. Oh, oh, oh. All right. I'm going to get you started back. Uh, what are we doing here? Oh, we got the headers right here, down here when the combines get done. He's going to be needing dumped. He's almost done. Guess I'll get this truck right here. I'm going to park you right there. I'm going to run this guy up to the farm shop. Oh my God, my money is going bye bye. cut through here um i hope i got a rake somewhere if not that straw there's gonna be wasted all right oh my god folks i'm in trouble i'm in trouble I'm pure D in trouble. And what I'm talking about is 
All right, I was going to go buy. I didn't see what that said. I was going to go buy some uh, liquid fertilizer. Oh, crap. Nowhere. Ooh, wrong button. Nowhere near close. I was going to go buy some liquid fertilizer, but I'm out of money. I do have one case left, I believe. Uh, Palette's work position. Yeah, ooh, yep, yeah, okay. So I got a work position. Um, yeah, all those are seeds right there. But anyway, um, like I said, I went about quarter to half mile upstream. Got stalled out, came floating back down pretty quick. I was on the wrong side of the bank. I was on the Tennessee side. Oh, no. What are we doing? I knew I should have moved him. Oh. But anyway, I was on uh, the Tennessee side of uh, the shoot instead of the Arkansas side that the you know the other guys are at. So no paddle, no paddle whatsoever, and here I am drifting. One thing I had in that boat I could savage was the hood off of the motor, the cover to the motor. So I'm like, oh my god. I'm going to drop that right there. Move him right there. While I get busy. I'm trying to see. One's got. 67. The oh man. The other 100%. I don't know. There we go. That, that ain't going to last long. All right. That wood figure is way down there on the end. But anyway, I finally got, I, I used the, the hood off that motor, outboard motor, to paddle my way over to the other side. And then I had to, trying to use my phone to get service, call the guys and, they was coming after me anyway. They they heard me. I couldn't hear them except for one of them getting on the PA hollering for me, and I started hollering for them. And they tried to come get me, but you just got another area that's all grown up and stuff, except for a few trails where people, you know, try to get to the bank. But anyway, a boat. These two guys come along, and of course I know they're probably not watching this, but if they are. Guys, thank you very much for towing my booty back to the boat ramp. I had a nice boat. Uh, I think he said it was a uh, 48, 48 inches wide uh, by 15. And it, it was sharp. It's all square boat. I love the square boats. And um, ooh, I'm almost full on this. And uh, after that... You know, we just brought it back to the house. I like, look, guys, I ain't got no tools out here to work on this. We have to go back to my house if we want the carpet cleaned out. So, went all the way back to the house, and I think it was around one thirty, two o'clock when we got to the house, and we spent from one thirty, let's say, just say two o'clock. Uh, ooh. I didn't know he was going to be stopping that soon. We spent from 2 o'clock to about 7, 7.30 working on the carburetor. I took the carburetor completely apart, took the filter apart. Um, the bottom of the carburetor was, oh my God, it was terrible. Full of rust and, and some of that gunk stuff. Y'all mechanics out there. Uh, Birch Mail and, and 
a few others, y'all probably know what let gas set up in a rubber hose for four months out in the sun. All day long in the sun. I, that's what I was dealing with. It was a two cycle oil attack, you know, two cycle oil mix with gas. And oh my god, you just it was a nightmare, folks. That's how my day was going. You know, I, I'm cooked. I got a bad headache. I guess that's from smelling the starting fluid and the gasoline and stuff. I'm cleaning the parts. I'm baked. My face is red, folks. You can probably light a match off of it. Unless he stopped. That car stopped. He ain't full. I think that car stopped. Come on, buddy. Why you stop? Hmm. Best way to fix these people like that is to pull on out in front of them. Folks, I want to buy 18 over so bad. It's unreal. Because I ain't got the money. I'm going to have to sell some of this just to get us out of the hole or me go do a couple of missions or something. I'd do some missions. We really need the grain and stuff for the pigs. But yeah, other than besides the headache, a lot of match, match off my face and uh just being tired and stuff. Well, oh, I'm full. It, it's this. Uh, I want to make this video so we all have something to watch. You know, 210 subscribers. And my son's been making a joke, and and everybody over here. If, if y'all watch Lance Stewart, Lance Stewart 210 or Lance 210, it's Lance. Y'all know his logo is 210. And I'm at 210 subs. So, yeah. That's what we've been laughing and talking about. Alright, he's almost done. Yeah, he is done. I don't know if I can fertilize these again. Let me get that off real quick. I use that line right there. Yeah, I think it will let me once if I can get in this area. I don't, this red line's at the end of it, and that green line is the center, but I can just go with this red line here. And I'll still be about the same distance, give or take. Alright, we're going to have to harvest these potatoes next time around, and the corn down there, and I think there's something else in there, or is it all corn? No, it's corn, potatoes, and the empty field, okay. 19, 20, 21. So, um, he, he's done. I will just get him. I don't think I can buy any. I'm mow and sell some grass. Sell some silage. That's what I'll do. Sell some silage. Now, I've been recording for about 19 minutes. What does that kind of like that? We are going to go ahead and stop this fella. Uh, 
and we're going to unload him and then we're going to take him over to field um, 19 that has corn on it. Alright, I'm going to get out and over. Whoa. Now, uh, the New Holland C CR-1090, New Holland CR-1090, I believe, has a uh, different mod pack out now where you can change colors of the combine and tires and color of the headers. It looks like it might come with a corn head also. So, folks, I don't know, are we leasing these, or did I buy them? I can't remember. Oh, I don't want that. I want the store. This is what I want. Garage. But, yeah, I figure I'd jump on here and give y'all something to watch tomorrow. Uh, what y'all think about... Uh, yeah, I bought them. There you go. Uh, Go Crest Xbox One. X, I mean, Go Crest PC and Xbox One. That was it. Oh. And uh, Giant Island going out. I think it's going to be kind of good, folks, in a way, in a way I don't. Uh, I know we're not supposed to do this, but I don't think I'm gonna park them right there. Let's see who owns this field. Oh yeah, George Watson ain't going. One point five million. Oh my God! Always round it up, folks. So yeah, one point five. Wow. We got a gold nugget challenge. Mr. Watson, can we park my header here? Park my header here so I can give you a little head for a little bit. I mean, a uh, header for a little bit. Dang, I'm going to say real quick. All right. All right there. Alrighty, righty. Righty, tidy. Let, oh, oh, man, come on now. He was almost done. Wow. Did I fer I don't know if I fertilized this field or not. It seems like we ain't got very much off of it. I, I know we ain't got a rate probably. Ah, we got more. Sorry, folks. I'm gonna hit the garage one more, one more time. Oh, they got mosquito flying around me. Sorry about that, folks. I am looking for a rake or a baler or something. We do have Baylor. Okay, good. Uh, we got the loader wagon, Baylor. Ah, we got a rake too. Just gotta figure out where they're at. Okay, he's playing. He's sitting there watching everybody. This guy's done and waiting. It's gonna leave him here for right now. Go find an empty tractor. I know I got one. I need to check something real quick, folks. And go down and take that off. I need to go do 19. 
and then we'll be done. And we'll have to use this to finish the rest of the pearl lines. So I'm going to have to make sure I got some manure. I'm going to have fast forward time or something. So we can get us some manure. Let's see here. Ah, no. Crap. I don't want to do that. Anytime you turn it, folks, and you just you just go right here and hit new, and it'll be automatically straight. I didn't really know that. I because always was doing like this, you know, getting it moved over, and I bumped these or something. And I don't know if I quite get it lined up this right, but you can go down here and hit new, bam, automatic. All right, now I need to scoot this over. About right there. All right, folks, I really don't think I can do another 30 minutes, so. No, 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 no. Why do the hired workers want to do that for? There we go. I know it's unrealistic, but sorry. Got to do it. Got to do it because. See down there? It's making that darker blue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to make to you. Waiting on you. We have, what, 19,000. I guess that's about right. Give or take. There should be a little bit more than that because I made this feel bigger. We'll find out here in a minute because I don't know how much is on him, really. I know I've been getting the... Uh, When I played the, the old one, you know, it used to be one of those green trailers and a little bit. So, that would be 21,000 plus about, about 25,000. So, yeah, that's about right. Did No, that didn't get all of it out. Oh, come on. Don't know who was driving that. J-Boo or Boo? All right. I really wish I could go in and edit these games. I don't know if we could do it or not, but I would like to change the names of the people, you know, the names they got in the game, which I probably can, just don't know how. All right, come on now. Right there. Bingo. What's his name, Mo? I ain't gonna bother folding my tops up because we ain't going that far. And then this here. Control F. And, uh, yeah. Well, folks, I, I hate to do it to you. But like I said, you know, I was out in the sun all day, which I wasn't even posted because of my medication. Uh, not no long periods of sun anyway. And, um, yeah, but at least I'm happy. I, I got me some money out of my boat. Not what I wanted to get out of it. Uh, I done told y'all this on other videos, you know, I was shooting for a thousand dollars. I got one battery on there. I got two solar panels. Uh, built in live well in the center. I took an air compressor and a copper line, ran it around up to the live well. So, uh, 
have some air in there for the fish. Make a bubble thing. They say that makes fish last longer. Had that in there, and the motor was Evero 99 or a Johnson, whatever you want to call it. Johnson Evero that year it was a 1975, I believe, or 1978 uh, Johnson 9.9 motor on outboard motor. Pull rope. Um, the lower foot part of it got bent, so I had to replace that. I've done it myself. Uh, didn't have no reverse in it, but that seemed to not to be a problem. And then the knob, you know, the handle that you twist to make it go faster, the gears was broke off in that. So I kind of figured I probably wouldn't get a thousand out of it because of that problem there. But yeah, I got a pretty decent price out of it. And, but I want to take that money and uh, get a few things for the kids' school and stuff. And then I'm going to turn around. Wait a minute, Mr. Jason. Yeah, you don't, I, I wish you would follow my tracks up here. But uh, what's left, I think I'm going to get me a drone. Uh yeah, I won't be one I'm wanting. I'm wanting the, the Maverick, the DJI Maverick. But uh, I'll probably be getting me this the DJI Phantom Three, just the standard standard Phantom. Which that's cool too, you know. In case I, I got buddy of mine. Uh, I think he already crashed his. But his is still working. Oh, I wish he would have uh, stopped somewhere different than right there, mister. Yeah, no, I don't even have to group stretcher. Wow. I'll just do this. That should cover it. I said I wasn't going to get into corn. Well, I think I'm going to go ahead and get started. And uh, when we'll come back, we'll finish up. I'm just going to start them like I did the other field. Get them going a little ways. Maybe get full or something. I don't know. There we go. Both thumbs in there. It'll be alright for a minute. Um, oh, okay. So we made 25,236 liters of barley off this field. I want to make sure I do all three fertilizations on it. Make sure we get the max out of it. my pipe a little and voila oh wait you got more than that what was I talking about this truck was empty oh my god I'm a, just a, a clutch alright 13 crap disappeared on me too fast 65,000 here And 13,000, so it's 78,236. Oh, yeah, yeah. We did get quite a bit. Okay. I was beginning to think because, you know, we spread this field out and so made it bigger. Oh, uh, crap. I got to find some words up this now. I wonder if it'll dump in that. Fertilized thing for seeds. I 
Uh, see something right there. But anyway, folks, uh, like I say, I'm sorry. Um, I ain't got too much to go, but I just don't feel like it. My head's hurting real bad, so I'm going to tear up these trailers and then I'm going to get off here. Yeah, eggs. Don't like to get eggs. It really ain't been fast forward time that much. Oh, God, these are. Whoa, back up, screw over. I'll just pipe down some more. It's one thing I'm glad about that, you know, adjust the pipe pretty good. All right. All right, folks, that's it. I'm done. Um, Y'all know the routine. Y'all want to subscribe, like my video, go ahead. Uh, I'm going to get off here. Uh, y'all take care. I'm going to get me some sleep. And I will see y'all Monday. And oh, I'm sorry there is no shout out video. I, I just, I ain't got the time, folks. Got busy uh, Saturday and stuff, so I, I just didn't have time to make it. I, I want to apologize, to everybody. And um, what I'll probably do once I get caught up with everything, I'll probably put one out Wednesday and again next Sunday. Because I got quite a few subscribers this time. So, uh, yeah, I gotta get off here, folks. I'm just, I'm wore out. I got some sleep. So, y'all take care. Have a good day, a blessed day. I will see y'all later. Bye.